What's going on everyone, my name's Matt and welcome back to a brand new video. Now today's video, I'm going to be going through something that I wanted to do for a long time but I've never really got time to actually do. I'm going to be doing a full on room tour. Yes, I'm going to be checking out Avalanche HQ and I'm going to be taking you guys with me. But first, we definitely need to get some breakfast. This right up here, some milk. Yeah, 100%. A bowl, yeah. Honestly can't stress enough how important that meal is. Breakfast, you've just got to do it. It just helps you out for the rest of the day. It's so freaking important. So this is Avalanche HQ. This is what it looks like. I know it's not very big, but this is my setup right here. Also, you've got, I'm sorry for like this dodgy looking bed sheet. The bedding is actually getting washed at the moment. So I haven't got like a dodgy bed sheet or anything. It's just getting washed. But this is what it's looking like. This is a custom built desk right here. Me and my dad did that. We actually put a work top in and then we got a few units from B&Q and we ended up actually going through our whole, whole the actual whole desk. That is a custom built PC right there. I'm pretty sure I've shown you guys that, that build in a video. Time lapse build actually. That cost me 500 pounds. I built that all by myself. Obviously we've got the Red Dragon Karua keyboard. That is something that obviously I've gone through in a, in a previous video. Obviously I've got like this dodgy TV, this dodgy old TV. I've had this for years, but I'm waiting to get some money to get Get, obviously get a monitor. I've got a matching Red Dragon mouse which will go with a keyboard that goes pretty nicely although this does blink different colours and that one stays on a separate colour. That's a bit strange. I need to sort that out. I've got me headset. This is a Logitech G231 Prodigy. Really nice comfy gaming headset. Definitely recommend that. I've got obviously my PS4. I'm a PS4 controller. Been taking a lot of beating recently with Fortnite and other games definitely. <laughs> I might need a new one by the time, by the time the air yeah, comes to a close, I definitely think that. I've got this like little nifty pocket knife right here. This is an actual Victorian Ox. If it actually focuses, please focus. I swear to God, this camera. So yeah, that is an actual Swiss Army knife right there. My granddad got me it. So, you know, it's something to definitely treasure that thing is. I use this for unboxings, all the different parcels I get when I buy new stuff. I definitely use this every single time. This thing up here is like my motivation wall. This is like a list of different like words and phrases that stop me to stop getting unmotivated if that makes sense. There's a load of cringy stuff on there but it just gets me motivated. I just need that. Uh, we got FIFA 18 chilling over here. Probably should have that in a case. That is a very expensive game when it first came out. I paid a lot of money for that. Obviously I got my gaming chair. I've had this for a while now. Uh, I got it about a year ago. It's a really comfy gaming chair but to be fair I need to kick, kick that out with some cushions. Definitely need to do that. I've got my tripod over here. I'm filming if I go to the mirror. I'm filming on my, obviously, my Canon 700D. I want my tripod, the Gorilla Pod. I'm going to have a mic up here soon, so definitely I'm going to be doing an unboxing on that. I'm filming with this Gorilla Pod, but for when this Gorilla Pod isn't tall enough, I use a basic standard tripod. This thing is an absolute rock. It's so sturdy. It's actually really heavy. I'm struggling to hold that right now. So I'm definitely going to put that down. But that is an absolute amazing tripod. You definitely need to kit yourself out with a Gorilla Pod and also a normal tripod. Also, I've got my bed. And also, I've got, I, forgot, I forgot to mention this hatch right here. This hatch is into the attic and there is the red dragon box and a load of cardboard boxes and that is it for today's video. Uh, so for here I got this like literally six months ago. I just keep that there. I'd never really sit on it. I've got a picture right there if that actually focuses that is my great granddad actually that's my great granddad who's called Sydney Gresham and like this thing like the problem with like that thing right there is like people will say, oh, why have you got that and stuff? But to be fair, like it's so important that you actually remember those people. Like people come around and you say, oh, why have you got that weird like old picture? But to be fair, like it's so important that you remember what those men fought for in World War One, and that's the reason why I have that there, so he can be remembered. So I definitely gotta, you know, I've got to keep that there. Obviously, I got a bedside table there, massive tiki mask. Uh, got that about four months ago. Uh, yeah, that's a really that you can actually hide stuff in. It's like actual mouth. If you actually move it out and stuff, you can hide stuff in there. Obviously, got the window there, and then literally got a wind like a, a mirror. I got an old school tie. I don't know why I even keep this. I've left school, so what's the what is the point? 
exciting in actually keeping that up there. I've got a Grimsby Town FC flag. Yeah, that's something um, Grimsby Town. Yeah, I don't, I shouldn't really have that flag because they're absolutely awful. Uh, yeah, I've got some battery packs down here. This is for my Canon camera. Um, got two battery packs and obviously I got the charger. Load of pictures, load of embarrassing photos. Yeah, you know, you know what I mean. Basically what I'm filming on at the minute, if I just close this door, this is a Canon 700D. I bought this for 340 pounds off ebay is a used this thing is used and the thing is like literally you wouldn't think this is used whatsoever like this 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 camera right here is an absolute beast as soon as i got it i i honestly thought it was new like no joke i honestly thought it was new but like literally i'm hoping to get like a mic up here like a road mic when i have enough money that is going to be the end of the video i hope you guys enjoyed obviously it's quite a small room, so I'm, I'm sorry for the short length of the vlog. Obviously, like if you enjoyed. It definitely means a lot to me. Obviously, I'm a small channel. Every like is heavily appreciated. Comment down below what you think of this video. But that is going to be the end of the video. I've been Mike. You guys have been awesome. And I'll see you guys in the next one.